Laugh out loud, love a lot, and shop for what makes you happy. Hey guys, Mandy here with an update on my e.l.f. haul. I'm sorry it took so long, I completely forgot to do it. Um, but I did save this stuff, so let me go through and um, kind of tell you my thoughts on everything. First, let's talk about the makeup remover pen. I really enjoyed it. I used it a lot. You can tell it's all black and gross, and I need to buy a new one. Um, but I did like that. Next up, I have the Eye Refresh. Now, my kids knocked the rollerball out of it, and I don't know where it went. Um, but I have been just putting it on my finger and dabbing it under my eyes, and that does seem to help, but I feel like the rollerball would be more helpful. So I do want to repurchase this. I'll just use up the serum that's already in here, though, before I do that. Next, I want to talk to you about the makeup removing wipes. I love them. I repurchased them um, and now I'm out of them again <laughs> so I'm back to um, the wet and wild ones which are also great uh, but I did appreciate with the elf ones that they have that kind of snap close lid instead of just this you know sticker thing on the front because um, these dry out really easily if you're not careful now let's talk about the eyeshadow palette I really enjoy the eyeshadow palette in fact um, I've been on several weekend trips this summer and this has kind of been my go-to throw it in my bag one because it has a pop of color, it has a few neutrals, so whatever I'm going to need, I have it in here, it's got the nice big mirror, um, so really enjoying that one. And I don't know if the Seaside Sweetie one is still available online, but um, I wouldn't mind getting more colors. And now let's talk about the lippies. Um, first off, I have the, I think this was the mineral lipstick, it doesn't say, it's the one that's in Nicely Nude. Um, this one I didn't really like. It didn't, um, the color was like really kind of, not just sheer, but like patchy. Um, you can't really, probably can't really see it. Eh, you can kind of see it. But see how it's kind of patchy? Like it's kind of dark here, but then lighter there. And for a lighter color, I don't understand why it would be patchy, but, um, didn't really, didn't really enjoy that one. Not going to use it. However, the moisturizing lipstick in Wink Pink, I do enjoy it's a pretty color, it's a nice formula, kind of an everyday kind of color, so I did enjoy that one. As for the dual-ended lipstick ones, I got the Best Berries and the Graphic Minimalist one by 11th Gorgeous. You're being too loud! Thank you. Um, I really enjoy the formula. It's very, um, kind of moisturizing. It's not, they're not matte, which I actually enjoy. I don't love the matte trend. Sorry, guys. I will be happy when it's over. Um, I enjoy the colors. However, what I don't enjoy is the packaging. Um, if you push too hard, I don't know if you're going to be able to see this. If you push too hard, it like pushes against the lipstick tube, which I find in a lot of e.l.f. lippies, they do that. So e.l.f., please work on your lipstick packaging because the formula is great and I love it. I just wish that it wouldn't you know, like rattle around in the, in the tube and get all mushed up. But I do like the formula. I need to use them more often. I hope you guys enjoyed this update. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below or over on the Facebook page at facebook.com slash laugh love shop. And I will see you next time. Bye.